Hey guys, it's Tiff. I just had a um, layout I wanted to share with you that I created. Um, so let's get started. The background paper is a Prima Mulberry paper and it's got, um, if you can tell, this yellow is stitching down the sides of it and I really like it. I got it at AC Moore and then um, the cream section is lined, but it's distressed, so some places it doesn't, you can't see the lines that well, and other places you can see them really well. So, I really like that. Um, that's the background paper. Then, um, I used some Martha Stewart doily, and I cut it in half, and I distressed one. I made it a little more blue than the other one, but it's the same doily that I just kind of cut up. And... Then I added, this is a recollections trim and just some navy card stock, um, another recollections trim. The one on this side came from this set and these are both from the springtime. I just happened to, um, still have some left and this is like a creamy yellowy color. Um, and then the other one came from, oh, sorry, I'm making a mess, this set, which is now a mess, and I had to fix it. But, anyways, I, um, then I also used some Jenny Bolin borders that look like this, and that is up here in this corner, and also down here, this zigzag is, um, a Jenny Bolin, part of that Jenny Bolin trim set. Then, um, Marley Scarborough, who was my October secret squirrel, sent me these felt flowers. So here's one, and here's one. This one's like a rose, if you can tell. Let's see. And this one's more like a daisy or something. And I thought about putting pearl in there, but this page is already super dimensional, so I decided not to. Um, she also sent these butterflies that are like cut out of this corrugated paper, which are really cute. And then I just took part of the top of this trim and cut it into sections of three and put it down all the butterflies. Then I took some of my new um, I am roses. Sorry, you can just tell this in my arm, but my new I am roses S10s, which I mostly got these for cards, but um. I know the S10s you can actually put on to pages because they're still semi-flat. So I wanted to play around with that a little bit. So I just have them kind of sprinkled throughout here. These are two more golden ones. And then I have some lighter pale ones in the corners. Then this um, is a cat scrappiness um, embellishment. You can check her out at catscrappiness.etsy.com or she's the cat's meow 1969 here on YouTube and um, she says these really cool embellishments and I had ordered these pockets and I distressed it with this um, I guess you can call it distress it anyways. I inked up the sides of it in, in these Martha Stewart colors it's just like a trio of blue chalk inks and it's also the ones I use for the doily I also used it on this doily punch, which I just used some green card stock and cut it out with this EK Success punch. Really cute. Then um, I just had this scrap border here that looks like this. And I cut a little banner at the top and a longer one at the bottom. And then this flower is from, um... oh no, I can't think right now. Carla, she was um, my Christmas in July mini album swap partner, and she had made this flower and sent it to me. And it's on a paper clip, but I, the paper clip was pink. And at first, I was like, oh, I kind of like the pop of a different random color, but I ended up just tucking it in because it is a little bit distracting. This is some My Mind's Eye paper that I just cut a strip of um, that I had left over as a scrap. It was from the Hattie collection. And then um, the title, the, the and Me, are in this, um, I think it's Obscure Basic Gray Alpha. I love this 
font. So that's the um, uppercase. And then this is the lowercase. So cute. Thank you, Kate, for getting me hooked on that. And then the new are these stickers here. And they're ones I got on clearance at Hobby Lobby. And they're delight foam stickers. And it's really like the font. Here's the font you get. Um, really really cute so anyways that is my layout and um, I really hope you guys like it it was a lot of fun to do and um, I am going to journal in the pocket by the way um, I just I don't like to journal until after I film the layout um, so um, yeah that's about it take care